cluttered. It's dynamic. Dynamic equals high distinction. Not in a choreography assessment. You want it to be less specky, more well crafted. So I've had some thoughts on our choreo assessment. Ow. Grace, it's due in two days. I've been working on a solo with Ethan. Another one? There, see? It's all there underneath. You just have to strip back the layers. Ah, oh, subtext. Hey, Grace. The chemistry in this room, out of control. I literally have goosebumps. What's she talking about? I get it. You're not ready to go public yet. My lips are sealed. Okay, that was weird. She has a warped imagination mm. from the jump. Yeah, sorry. Uh, do you want some music with that? Yes. Ethan and me. <laughs> Are you off your meds? Just telling it like it is. Stop. He's earnest and shiny. And he fell for Tara, so he can add weak-minded to the list. Well, good. I hate it when friends disappear because of some guy. Good. We can't even be in the same room now. I'm gonna fail my assessment. We'll whip something up. I'm thinking we can harness my recent Joy Division obsession. What do I tell him? Wasn't he just doing you a favour? He'll cope. I really appreciate all your help, but this isn't gonna work. Yeah, totally agree. I've been watching these clips of an ensemble who actually play with speed rates. It's given me a really cool idea. Come, I'll show you. Okay, stop there. Now we're gonna do exactly the same movements, but this time at a slower frame rate, okay? Okay. Now keep it fluid. Last chance to flash mob tomorrow, you guys in? Yeah. yeah. Get pumped. Uh, devil pay. Okay. Okay. Yes, it's weird, but we're both focused. We're both ambitious. Sounds hot. We could be like the new Natasha and Sebastian of the ballet world. Did I actually just say that? about before huh? the whole teasing you and Abigail totally juvenile uh, don't worry about it projection excuse me I think that's what it's called when you accuse someone of feeling a certain way but it's actually you who has those feelings Abby wait please Abby I have no idea what just happened. I was talking to Ethan, trying to suss out what was going on with you guys, and then his tongue was down my throat. I think your phone might need recharging. I don't take social calls during exam week. Right. So I'm guessing that you're not going to get much of a holiday with the Prix de Fontaine coming up? Mm, how perceptive. Prep classes start tomorrow. Well, I've got a few ideas for a new classical solver. You want to work together again? Yeah, I've been looking forward to it. Yeah, well, unfortunately, the dancer-choreographer relationship is based on trust. Okay, I'm gonna go out on a limb here. This is about Grace launching herself at me the other day, isn't it? She wasn't the one doing the launching, Ethan. Someone's playing games here, Abigail. It's not me. Last night was fun. Yeah, you did a good job getting rid of Kat. She deserved it. She lied to Tara's face. So it was all for Tara. <laughs> it kind of seemed like you're out to get Kat the moment she hijacked your night. Judgment abs, really? You've done a lot worse. Only to get ahead of the academy. Not for fun. Ethan. I have five seconds before pre-class and one question. 
If you choreograph my solo, do I still get co-credit? <laughs> nope. Tara, you're moving especially constipated today. I'm supposed to be at the front. I will see you wherever you are. It's terrific to have you all here. I'm Stephen Heathcote, one of your judges today. 20 years as principal dancer. The man is superhuman. We're super gonna start human. today with a fairly typical ballet class. Then, this afternoon, you guys are gonna show us your solos. Should be a fun day. Yeah. I was just coming to talk to you about Tara. I'm really worried about her. Me too. The judges are going to annihilate her this afternoon. Look, I know that this is a lot to put on your shoulders, but I need at least one girl to get through to the nationals. And Grace is unpredictable. How well do you know the red shoes? I've seen Tara struggle through it a zillion times. But what about the piece Ethan choreographed for me? The red shoes, when it's performed right. Unbeatable. Classical variations will commence in 10 minutes. Please clear the stage. Hey. So I haven't changed my socks in three days. It's a good luck ritual. It's unnecessary. I've decided to go with another solo. What? But, Abigail, we've been working on this for weeks. Mm-hmm. Hey, I know. It's risky going with new choreography, but trust me, you're gonna be fantastic. It's amateurish. Look, Ethan, you might need it for your showreel, but I can do better. Will you do that, Abigail? Okay, you're going to have to dig deep on those PK turns. I wasn't planning on coasting. In the posing and attitudes, focus on your upper body, okay? Because Tara's expressive. There's no point doing this if you're not going to be better than her. <laughs> All semester, you've been entertainingly vocal about how crap she's at this solo. No. I know why you hate her so much. I don't. I've got the academy to think about. Please. I've been there with Tara jealousy. I'm the youngest principal in the history of the company. I'm not jealous of anyone. <sighs> I knew she was good. I just never thought she was good enough to scare you. Excuse me. You didn't leave? Yeah, I was banking on the socks that you change your mind and judging from the costume. That completes the boys section. Ladies with surnames beginning A to E, please make your way to the stage. So I have a question, dancer to choreographer. Go for it. I was just wondering if this was Strictly a professional relationship between us. Introducing Abigail Armstrong, dancing an original piece by Ethan Karamakov, representing the National Academy. Did that clear it up for you? Totally professional. <laughs> 